According to the CDC, about one in every 1,600 babies in the U.S. is born with cleft lip with cleft palate. One in every 2,800 is born with cleft lip without cleft palate. NBC 29's Anahita Jafari talked with a professional from UVA about the technology it's using to help children. Cleft lip and palate is when a baby's mouth does not completely form during pregnancy. It is one of the most common facial birth defects in the United States. So it's about one in every 700 um, newborns at risk for difficulties with feeding, language development, speech um, production, hearing, and dental health. Kaslin Mason works with children experiencing these birth defects. There is a big quality of life piece to this diagnosis. Mason says UVA is looking for improved ways to help these children develop speech and have better surgical outcomes. We are doing some exciting work with MRI technology or magnetic resonance imaging, and we're developing new ways to analyze speech data and optimize those surgeries for these children. She says about 25 to 30 percent of these speech surgeries are failing. And that's because there are some gaps in how we actually assess speech and pick surgeries for these children. They are developing new clinical tools to help. So patients aren't having unnecessary or additional procedures to achieve their desired speech outcome. UVA is actively looking for parents and children who have cleft palates to recruit for their clinical studies. In studio, Anahita Jafari, NBC 29 News.